Hey, what's up? Um, I just heard the big news yesterday that uh, Gen 2 video, text to video is now open on Runway ML. And I'm going to play with it today. And here is some of the stuff I came up with. <clears throat> trying to look for crazy prompts. Here's the very first one, if you can see it. Um, I was thinking about ideas and I put in strawberries floating in the skies of a beautiful alien world. And I will play that for you. Here we go. It's pretty cool. There's not a lot of movement. Let's let me make it bigger here so you can see it. I'll play it again. There's some weird uh, forming going on on the strawberry right here, but it's pretty good. I like it. I just generated from a Beatles lyric because I thought that would be cool, but actually didn't come out that cool. I put in a uh, newspaper. Uh, you know, this is from Lucy in the Sky with Diamonds. Newspaper taxis appear on the shore waiting to take you away. Climb in the back with your head in the clouds and you're gone. And this is the image I got. Uh, it's just a bunch of cars facing different directions and some clouds in the sky. And here I'm playing it for you. And there's barely any movement. So I'll zoom in here. Yeah, there's really no movement going on whatsoever. So it's a really static image. So I'm not that impressed with this one. Okay, I got my glasses on for this one. I got reading glasses because I need them sometimes. Anyway, I put in another code word here, keywords I should say. Uh, super futuristic car driving in Tokyo 30 years in the future from now. And I have to say I was not that impressed with this one either. I will play it for you. Here we go. So basically we have a car that's standing still but everything moving around it. So it's just like somebody in Photoshop stuck this here and on top of a moving image. So there we go. However, it has some cool buildings in the background, um, some futuristic elements, but overall, I don't know. Let me make it big here so you can see it better. And I don't know. It's okay. It's a little better than the last one, but it's not great. Hey, yet another one here. Uh, this one was pretty cool, actually. I think this might be the best one of all. So here's the keywords I put in. Uh, cute and chubby anime girl running on the beach in Enoshima, Japan. And uh, you can be the judge. Here it is. Boom. It kind of looks like Enoshima. I've been there. Uh, it, her, the movement is great. The waves are great. Everything is good. This character looks a bit wonky now that I look at it closely. But yeah, it's got great motion. It's definitely an anime girl. I'll make it big here. You can see it better. And it's pretty cool. Play it one more time because this one's the best by far. Okay, and that's it. I think I'll definitely download this one. I didn't download the, the other ones because I didn't think that it was worthwhile. But this one's worthwhile. Okay, here's an interesting one. I put in this time Donald Trump because a lot of people are doing these kind of videos I noticed online. Um, Donald Trump eating ramen with his hands in a izakaya, which is a Japanese style restaurant. Um, yeah, people usually do it with a spaghetti, but I chose ramen just to be different. And it's funny because it gave him a Japanese face, but it's got his hair, as you can see. And he's eating one strand here, and there's not a lot of motion. And the other people aren't really moving at all. But I'll play the video and let you see it. Here we go. Oops. <clears throat> yeah, so it's okay. It's interesting. Yeah, there's the motion's not great, but yeah, I'll just play it one more time here. The background, nobody's moving at all. This guy's not moving. Anyway, uh, that's it for that one. Hey, here's another one. I'm coming up with more and more random ideas. So for this one, just popped into my head. Why not do another famous person? So I said Brad Pitt riding a banana shaped motorcycle in Antarctica and this one's okay actually I'll play it for you so yeah I think it's cool it definitely got Antarctica it definitely got uh, a cool looking motorcycle I thought it'd be more silly looking like a banana shape I mean it's kinda got this shape here but it's actually a cool looking modern motorcycle I'm impressed with that uh, 
you can tell the silhouette. I think it, you can tell it's Brad Pitt, but you can't really tell. It looks like a generic guy because it's kind of far away. But the composition's good, and I think it's a pretty cool image. I'll make it bigger here. Uh, let's play it. Yeah, it definitely kind of looks like Brad Pitt or a, a generic guy that looks like Brad Pitt. Anyway, uh, yeah, that's kind of a cool video. This one was a complete flop for obvious reasons. <clears throat> Got to clear my voice, sorry. I put in uh, for the prompt, the progressive rock band Rush playing music on stage rendered in a detailed anime style. And this is what I got. There's, I just played it for you. There's barely any movement. It looks nothing like the band Rush. It looks nothing like anime style. The guitars are all wonky. So I would avoid this type of prompt. It doesn't seem to be able to do uh, like detailed band members and stuff like that. So this one was interesting. I didn't get the result I wanted, but it was kind of a cool image. I probably put in too many keywords. Uh, I probably made it too complicated for it to uh, you know, come up with the right image. But what I put in was a futuristic bus crashing into a small modern car at high speed in a neon lit cyber city from the distant future. So I got overly ambitious and it was confused, but this is the image I came up with. Here we go. You know, the lighting's really cool. I love that uh, neon light look. Here we go. The car is interesting. It looks like it's kind of like half built or something like that. And, but the light coming through it is awesome. There's a guy standing here. It's kind of like it's got nice glass or something, see, you know, see through glass here in these sections. It is modern looking. It is a cyber city from the future, that's for sure. Anyway, it's kind of cool. I don't know what to make of it, but I think I'll download this one. I think this will be my last one for this video today. I want to use up all my um, seconds, but not right now. I'm just going to edit this video and then do another video. Okay, that last one was a really cool image, but it wasn't really expressing what I wanted. So I thought to make a really simple prompt. And I still didn't get what I wanted, but it had uh, nice elements to it. So basically this time I made it really simple for the AI to figure out what I wanted. And I put in a truck smashing into a car. So basically, um, this is what I got. So obviously it's a truck on fire, a guy, a workman or something standing here. And I guess this is the car it hit, but I'm not really sure. I mean, it's a pretty simple prompt. I'll make it big. Here we go. Yeah, so it's cool. It's like the aftermath, but yeah. Okay, I'm going to upload this video, edit it, and get back to you guys. Okay, I'll talk to you soon.